Endermen move blocks. It's what they do. Guys, come on. We gotta build a new one, like right now. Come on, faster. We need more blocks. I got some. Yeehaw! Woo! Oh, Axel, you're screaming in my ear. Sorry. We made it! We actually freaking made it! Jesse, Petra was saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. She was inside the wither. She might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way she's been acting. I'll go talk to her. Hey, how are you feeling? I don't really feel like myself. I still can't believe you're even alive. Do you not recognize us? I'm Axel. This is Olivia. She doesn't know us. Any of us. But we've known her for- Practically forever. I know, I know, but... Look at her. Jesse, this is awful. You, Jesse. You're the one who rescued me. Tell me, please. What is going on? All I remember was endless blackness. And then... You were there. Up until a little while ago, we all thought you were... You know... I thought I was too. All I know is, I was so scared in there. I thought for sure I was dying. Well, you didn't. You made it back alive. That's more than I can say for some of us. Oh man, Eligard. For a second I almost forgot. Are we talking about Eligard? Yeah. Ah, oh, Ellie. Still can't believe the old girl's gone. How? How could this have happened? To lose not just a friend, but a member of the Order of the Stone! She was really something else. Even if she did make me feel like the dumbest guy in the world sometimes. Indeed. Ah! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is, what happened out there today? Why is that thing still alive? My instructions were simple. You were the one in the middle of everything. What went wrong? You tell me. Excuse me? Well, you're the one who thought we could destroy the command block with a big old ball. So the command block is still out there? Of course it is. Oh, great. And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one wither storm to three. Our plan was a total failure. I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. Why didn't I destroy that cursed block ages ago? Well, plan A didn't work. So the question is... What's plan B? Oh, uh, why are you asking me? Am I expected to know every last thing in the universe? Uh, I need a moment to think. Is he always like this? <laughs> you have no idea. That jacket, it looks familiar. Lucas always wears that jacket. No, I saw other people wearing it when I was being thrown from that... that monster. Ah, Even thinking about it hurts. Hey, hey, it's okay. Jesse, if what Petra said is true... I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but... if they were just trapped in the wither storm... Listen, if my friends are alive, I've gotta go after them. They might need me, Jesse. <gasps> The room. Everything's spinning. You're okay. Easy does it.
Jesse. Hello. Just making the rounds. I know you're not feeling well, Gabriel, but we can't stay here long. We have to keep moving. As much as I wish I could leap to my feet and launch myself back on that horse, I... <laughs> I'm running on fumes here. You need to rest. You're right, I do. Look, Jesse, wherever you guys go next, give him some time to get his strength back. The problem is, we don't have time. Jesse's right. In fact, it might be best if my journey ends here. This cave is safe, easy to defend. It's relatively comfortable. I might even find a shred of peace. I'm sorry, Jesse. I wish I were stronger. <sighs> Nothing had to turn out like this. If the order had just been different, if we'd made smarter choices, Ivor wouldn't have turned into a maniac and... Well, maybe Elagard would still be alive. Come on, let's, let's not talk about the old days. But how can we not? So many lives torn asunder. The world ripped to pieces. None of this is your fault, Gabriel. All this talk of the past has me exhausted. You need to rest. Will he be okay? I don't know. Just get back out there and kick some butt. For the both of us. Gravel? No. Dirt? <clears throat> don't think so. <sighs> Some leftover cobblestone. Might come in handy. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you. I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead. But if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far. But I can't leave them alone out there. You're right. They do need you. And the best way to help them is to help us beat that monster. That sounds right, but it just doesn't feel right, Jesse. Lucas. Look, you and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you'll understand why I need to go help my old friends. They do it for me. I can't believe I'm saying this, but if your heart's telling you to go, then you gotta go. Otherwise, you'd be heartless or something. <laughs> Thank you, Jesse. I'll find them. And then I'll find you again, too. I promise. Thanks. You came along. Just don't tell Ruben I said that. He might get jealous. Look, Soren. I said I needed some space, Jesse. Actually, you said you needed time to think. So. Did you think of anything? Not really. I'll let you know if I do.
Petra, how are you doing? Are you remembering things yet? I... I don't know. These little flashes keep coming back to me, but then they float away again. We've been trying to talk to her, but... It's like she's never met us before. I know I've met you before. Before today, I mean. I just don't remember... how, exactly. I keep seeing a... dark alley? But then that turns into trees. And that turns into... being way up high, above a river. Hang on. Didn't I save your life at some point? Uh, make that at many points? Yes, it's working! You're remembering Jesse! Do you remember me too? No. And yet, I feel like I know all of you somehow. Maybe it's the way you're dressed. Of course you know us! We're the Dead Enders. The Dead Enders? Wait, didn't we all fight that Wither thing together? Yes! We totally did. She remembers it. I remember running to a, a, a temple in the woods and we were gonna be safe there. And how did I end up inside that thing? Um, uh, well... Something bad happened there. Look, there were two of you caught in the tractor beam that day and, well, I helped Gabriel. The sick guy over there. Oh. Yeah, I think I do remember that. You gotta realize, I thought we needed him. If it was just about who I liked... No, I, I get it. You did what you had to do. All that matters is you're with us now. And that you're still a fighter. The best one I know. So, what do you say? Will you be a part of our group again? All right. Count me in. <laughs> Ugh, a pig? Robin! <sighs> Not again. Robin! Don't run off on me like that, okay? I hope Gabriel will be okay. I mean, he's supposed to be Gabriel the warrior. And instead he's... Well, you saw. I guess none of the order are how we imagine them. The world needs us, Reuben. So much of it has already been reduced to bedrock. And it's up to us to save the rest of it. Well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig. But we have to find a way. That's what I said, isn't it? Oh, just as you once helped us before. This isn't about the past, it's about the future. There are three of those things now. You say that like it's my fault! It is your fault! Oh, take responsibility for what, Soren? I did that by locking the command block away. So only you could use it! Ah, oh, do you still not real- Soren, you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? Jesse, you shouldn't sneak up on people. Ignore him, Jesse. He's been following us. It's not like that. You need to hear me out. What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> Obviously! No. I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. You mean the Order's amulet? 
Yes, Soren. That amulet. Gabriel doesn't have that amulet. Just...